Welcome back, guys. Uh, I'm gonna continue our let's play of uh, Dino Crisis, entitled Plumbing for a reason. Not really. Well, yes, there's a reason, but not a big reason. What's the emergency? Gail just told me he saw someone on the underground monitor. I like how uh, how randomly we get back together. We're never like organized. Like, okay, guys, we're gonna meet back in like ten, two hours. It's a distress signal from one of our team members. It must be Cooper. Okay, so here's um a part of the game where you have to pick which way you go, and it changes like what you do pretty much. However, if I'm correct, there's only one one of these choices. It's not this one, but there's like a few different times where you have to where you have to pick which way you go, and only one of them actually affects the ending. What are you talking about? He's asking for our help. We don't leave our own behind. And what if it's a trap? Would you want one of us to come and rescue you? Don't bother. I'm willing to take that risk. Remember <laughs> our mission. We're not here to babysit. That's your way to help you. All right. <laughs> he he typed angrily. So get moving. You handle your things your way, I'll handle my thing. Yeah, this isn't a very organized team. Like, how many missions have we done together before, and this guy's just so defiant. I mean, I don't think in, like, a secret agent kind of team like this, I don't think the commander would ever take this shit. Oh, which way do I go? I think I'm gonna go Rick's way. Only because that seems nicer, I guess. Because if I go Gale's way, I s actually, I don't know. I sort, of, I sort of feel like if I go Rick's way, I'm going to end up fighting a really powerful dinosaur. I don't know. But at the same time, it's like if Gale, like, if I go with Gale, I think I'm going to fight a bunch of dinosaurs. I guess we'll find out. Oh my god, this music. I hate it. Like, it's here and there's like another place that has this music and it's just so horribly, it's horrible. Because it sounds, just the way it sounds makes you feel like you're being attacked all the time and there's nothing in there. I think there's only a dinosaur in that last room like once and then that's it. Once the gate gets uh, pulled down it's fine. Oh wait, no, it's this room. Yeah, see? The music. Music hates me. Oh, what am I gonna get attacked here? I just have this huge feeling that I'm gonna get attacked in this in this uh, big old area. Now I know that uh, they do this because it's easier. Because this is an old game, it's a PS1 game. But, wh why is it that the bodies of the dead die, like, disappear? Like, this is in Resident Evil as well, but, like, they disappear. Unless if it's, like, part of the scenery, or, or if it's something that you need. Like, you have to pick an item off the dinosaur, or, or the zombie, or whatever. Unless if it's that. Oh, something's here. How did he get past him? Like, it looks like he just kind of smacked the dinosaur and... Oh, there's another one somewhere. <sighs> dinosaurs. I wish, it, I wish I had ammo for my pistol. Instead of using all my ammunition on... Oh, slag bullets, I need those though. I don't have barely anything as is. <sighs> I don't even, like, I really don't know what N.A. does. Like... See, that one doesn't do anything, really. And it says the level goes up a bunch. But it's like, it's medpack M+, plus, and just regular and M+, plus, all, they both heal complete. I don't know. It just... It's like, what's the point of even adding that if... 
<sighs> yeah, I... I don't know. I'll take the slag bullets. And I get lashed. <sighs> you freaking bitch. <sighs> See, what, what, what is the point of that? The dinosaur's on the ground, he... Obviously, he doesn't have enough energy to get up. But he decides that, oh, I'm gonna smack you around anyway. Oh, what was that? Oh, of course. At least, I guess it's not a T-Rex. Oh, my bodies. Oh, cool. I'm gonna be fed to little pterodactyl babies. My gun. Danger, danger. Oops. God, I'm just thrown around like a rag doll. That's one thing I kind of admire about this game. In comparison to, uh... I want my shotgun back. Shotgun. Uh, in comparison to Resident Evil, because in Resident Evil, you could, like, push off the zombies. But in this, man, the dinosaurs just mess you up. And I can't see where the enemy is. Reacted, I think. How can it swoop down and hit me anyway? Like, from where I'm at. I get it? I guess so. Um, because in Resident Evil you could push off the, uh, the zombies and stuff, but in this game, man, the dinosaurs just... just... <laughs> they throw you around like a little toy. You're just like, oh god, you're just on... you're just in there for the ride. Now, I'm looking through my my health items right now and all my other items and I'm starting to realize have I ever needed to heal yet like I'm suspecting that the bottom right of Regina Regina whatever her name is uh, indicates the health because in Resident Evil you know you got like this caution bar and it starts out green and it goes yellow and then red and this one's blue and I'm guessing blue is a good color but I don't think I've ever seen it change like, I know I'm playing on easy, but still. Maybe I should have chose me normal. No, because then I would have ran out of bullets like nobody's business. At least now I'm doing okay. Like, I've like got a neutral thing going on with a shotgun. Please update my MySpace and Twitter. My last request. His wounds are pretty, like a, you have to move his wounds are pretty bad. I think he just passed out. If not died. Ah, oh, thing. Okay. That's useful, I suppose. Oh, there's something else. Another thing. I'm just getting... Oh, I got the L's. I don't know where the L's go. This looks pretty bad. I know. Listen, I'll take care of it. No. Maybe, like I was talking about the health items, maybe I'll uh, stop carrying around so many, because there's like those weird, uh, what are they called? I don't even know what they're called, but like, there's these like chest things that hang on walls, and there's like a few of them. And you could store items in them. They also have items in them, which is useful. But... No ammo, which is awesome, because I really, really need ammo. But that's what the, like, Capcom does in these kind of survival horror games is... Oh, cool, more freaking pterodactyls. See, how do you... How do you... Uh, how did it get down so fast? Aw, uh, yeah! <sighs> Oh, why am I shooting? Maybe I should just dodge these things. I'm not... I'm not hitting them enough. Um... Yes, yeah, so maybe I should toss some of my healing items in those things because... I don't know, they're wasting too much space and I am not getting hurt enough, I guess. I mean, that's a good thing, but... Yeah. 
At least give me a reason to carry these items. Maybe easy is too easy. Except on your ammo. Because everything likes to play dead. Uh, I'm guessing I have to play around with a crane sometime in the near future. You know, I'm uh, looking at that thing over there again. I'm, I've already recorded this and I've gone way past this part. And I'm thinking maybe I could have pushed that uh, shelf. Okay, I guess this is a puzzle. Hmm. Oh, fun. Let's figure this out. Okay. Blue one, I choose you. Oh, look at that. Fits nice and snug. Okay, now what do these ones do? Okay. Well, obviously that one doesn't go there. I can't switch them out, so... Okay, this is gonna be a while. Oh, boy. Alright. Here. Hmm. <laughs> that doesn't go there. Okay. I think... I'm, I think I'm getting this now. But it also depends on the other side, because I have to just reset the whole other side. And I have to reset it in the other order. <laughs> why, why can't the pipe go through? This is stupid. This isn't very fun. Yeah, but it's understandable. But then again, why, why do they have blue, red, and green pipes? Why not just regular pipes? Okay, so I'm pretty sure that green goes in the middle. Because you also have to, like, do this, like... I think it might be best if I just do one side and then do the other. That way I don't mess up. Huh. Okay. Oh, that was the wrong one. The way that they showed it off messed me up. There we go. Now, uh, keep in mind, I don't know what I'm doing right now. I got the blue ones going. I think I have to take it out to get the red one in there. Hell, I think I have to get the green one up to get the red one in there, too. Yeah! Hey guys, isn't this fun? Look at how much entertainment I'm having. Also, keep in mind that I <laughs> did cut out a bit of this. Not a lot, like maybe a minute's worth, but still, the fact that I spent a minute more than what you're seeing. And once again, I am very stupid. I'm very, very dumb. Okay, I gotta get that blue one up. What, whoa. Different camera angle. Get the blue one up, then put the green one, then the blue one, and we should be done. If I can figure out which one to do. Uh, do, do, do. All this amazing... And I'm sure you guys are just loving this. You're like, yeah, oh man, why do I do anything else but watch this? How does this provide power? Oh well. I'm going to cut here. This has been me playing. We'll continue later.